All right. Um, good afternoon. Good morning. Good evening. Good night. Depending on when you're watching this video, if you watch it today, happy Thanksgiving. Um, we are going to work through the exercises on slide 12 of lecture set number six. So lecture set number six is devoted to the sampling distribution of the sample mean. So all of our exercises are effectively going to be illustrations of how to compute the parameters of the distribution, describe the distribution, and work with the distribution. Uh, and when I say distribution, I mean the sampling distribution. So in this exercise, <clears throat> it says, there is evidence that the birth weight of babies, um, that the mean birth weight of babies, this should be the mean, the mean birth weight of babies is 3,369 grams with a standard deviation of 581 grams. State the variable of interest, okay? So this is simply what we are interested in measuring, which is the birth weight of babies. Okay, pretty straightforward. Part B, for all samples of size 200, find the parameters of the sampling distribution of the sample mean. Okay, so, in all cases, no matter what distribution we are sampling from. So in all cases, the sampling distribution of the sample mean has parameters mu subscript x bar equals mu and sigma subscript x bar equals sigma over the square root of n. So these are the parameters of the sampling distribution of the sample mean, no matter what population we sample from. Okay, so mu x bar is the mean of the sampling distribution of the sample mean and sigma x bar is the standard deviation of the sampling distribution of the sample mean. And those definitions are given on slide um, nine or 10. So we just wanna calculate these two things. Okay, so in our situation, okay. So in this exercise, mu is equal to 3,369. And sigma is equal to 581. Okay, we're told that in the problem. So therefore, okay, mu x bar is equal to 3,369. And sigma x bar is equal to 581 divided by the square root of 200. Because in this problem, we're asked, for the sampling distribution, the parameters in the situation where the sample size um, is 200. Okay, so that means that sigma x bar is 41.083. All right. Okay, so those are the parameters of the sampling distribution of the sample mean. In this example, for all samples of size 200. Okay, in part C, it says, for all samples of size 400, find the parameters of the sampling distribution of the sample mean. So this is the exact same exercise. We're just changing sample size. So here we're gonna have mu x bar is equal to 3,369. And sigma x bar is now going to be 581 divided by the square root of 400, which is 29.05. Right. So when we're asked to find the parameters of the sampling distribution of the sample mean, it means compute mu subscript x bar and sigma subscript x bar. Mu subscript x bar is directly equal to the population mean and sigma subscript x bar is equal to the population standard deviation divided by the square root of n. 
Okay. As always, if you have any questions, please let me know.